most important question that led to the orphanage being founded was where are all the rhino babies? Because when you read newspapers, they tell you about rhinos that were poached, but they say nothing about the rhino babies. And the stats that we see don't include the babies that are casualties of this um, rhino poaching scourge. So no one cares about the babies, no one talks about the babies, no one even mentions what they do with the babies when they found the mother being poached. Obviously the issue is here in Africa, but it affects everyone. Uh, I'm from Pennsylvania and we're an international group and we all care about these issues. And so by helping out at the Rhino Orphanage and spreading information about the work that they do, it can just really hopefully help solve the problem. Uh, also through the organization, we help to raise funds. There have been four different groups of youth who have come through this program since its inception. Last year, they helped to raise the funds to relocate 10 rhinos from South Africa to Botswana so they can be in a safer area where they're less likely to be poached. And this year, we're hoping to raise funds to help out the rhinos in a different way. So each year, the group tries to have a goal to help do a big change, but also just have a presence. We cannot do as much work as they do. They are the heroes. We just happen to be there with our cameras to show the ca uh, who the heroes are. And it's not always easy to put something like this together, but we just felt that it doesn't matter how small it is that we keep, um, I think every single one of us is very passionate about, and we just wanted to do our little bit. Like you say, just yeah. have a voice. Yeah. Oh, that's Thank you. So, so anyway, <laughs> On behalf of the well, Maniac's Breakfast Run Club, <laughs> we would like to donate 11,000 rand. Oh, wow. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Well, as you know, we are a non-profit, so we survive purely of your donations. And as Virgin would say, we, we do work with the rhinos and we put a lot of time, but we wouldn't be able to do it without your support. So even though... Um, we love our jobs. We'll never be able to, to look after the rhinos properly if it wasn't for you. Okay.